Good morning, friends, everyone, or afternoon, evening, wherever you are on the planet at this time that you actually are viewing this video. I just wanted to come pop on for before the weekend because I know this weekend, usually I take a break from posting on the weekend just because I like not to look at my phone. <laughs> I like to engage in everything that's going on and uh, we've got some things going on. We have some really exciting things in our life right now. And it's just, you know, you can be working away at something for a long time and sort of feeling out the best way to go and you kind of go one direction, you go another, and there's not really a, a wrong way to do anything. And as you go, you learn about yourself and you learn how to listen more to your intuition and, you know, all of those kind of things. Sometimes you listen, sometimes you don't, you learn a lesson what you should do next time and it's so interesting because lately there's just so many changes like my my son earlier this year he goes to high school he's got one year left and he'll graduate next year and earlier this year he was having a really rough time and we talked about it and instead of feeling like he had to stay stuck doing the same thing we actually researched other schools that he could go to and we applied and he got into another one. So he is embarking on a new chapter for his grade 12, you know, where, you know, sometimes a lot of kids will stay because this is where their friends are. This is, he was choosing to do something for himself that's different. My other son, who's, I have three that have graduated and I, I got my, my baby. He's not a baby though. Um, grad, he hasn't graduated. I have three that are out of high school and they're all doing such amazing things that my girls have opened up their micro bakery. My youngest daughter has her own art business and she's been applying to attend different art um, programs, you know, to do different things. My older daughter's doing that and she's working for some other companies that are treating her very well. And it was so interesting last night to hear my kids talk about business because my um, other son who's uh, in his 20s too he just got in with a company with a really great opportunity and the funny thing is he said you know I don't feel stressed you know there's a lot to learn but I'm so excited and I think that's even how I'm feeling about my own life is we always talk about manifesting working towards something you know, no, no matter how you think you're going to get there, right? I mean, there's so many different ways. There's a lot of life coaches and, you know, people that are like hustle, grind, work hard. And then there's others like go with the flow. And there's so many different ways to get to a place that no one really talks about what it's like when you get there. You know, for years doing light work and work for myself and shadow work for myself and then teaching those skills to my children was really my thing and I've been an author I am an author actually a published author I am also a voice actor I still do work in that area and it's interesting because there are a lot of things I wanted to do that this year in the last few months we've just went boom 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 figured out how to do it and we just opened our shop so we have merchandise now in our shop we put up um we have courses. I have my writing courses that I put up there. If you saw the video I posted yesterday, I we have all our services up there. So we teach Qigong and we teach Bagbajong. And if you want to know more about those, I can do a video on those um, after. But we want to help people create a bridge oops, from the physical to the spiritual because there's a lot of things where people focus on sort of one area but there's a whole bridge that needs to happen in between. So, you know, we're working on some really exciting things with people and with each other. And we also have another dream, you know, I'll say quote unquote, because, you know, everyone has a dream. And it's just like right there too. And we're just deciding like, okay, well, which step are we going to take right now into just doing it? Because sometimes you just have to do something and, and get started. And then you see. And then there was another job opportunity that came up for me because it's, it's part-time and something that's supplemental. And it's interesting because no one tells you how you're going to feel when you get there because you don't know. And as you're going through the process and even when you're accepting that you've manifested and you've brought these things into your life, 
your shadow can try to trigger your ego into old stories and if you don't deserve this or if you have things still you have to let go of you gotta sweep out the cobwebs of you know things that you still have inside and so it's it's always so interesting i always need to stop and go back to feeling gratitude for everything that i have and just check in with how i feel because you can gain that momentum in building something and then be like oh wow like I'm actually here. I'm actually doing it. This isn't just a thought anymore. This isn't just a dream. This is like you're living it. And you don't really know how you're going to feel when you're actually living what you've been working on for a long time. So if you're feeling anything odd or out, out of sorts, because I know the last week or so with all the energy shifting, um, my body just feels really up and down. There's, I've had some interesting happening. So really listening to your body is so important. And that's something that I help people with is learning how to listen to their body, what it, the messages that it's telling them. So some exciting times are happening. So drop, you know, some, some comments there. If you're living your dream or if you are working on something and, and how are you feeling? Just let me know. How are you feeling today? How are you feeling about everything that's going on? Love to know. And have a great weekend.